Oh no. Here it comes. It's the keeper. Oh god, we lucked out. It's Lilith. <coughs> I thought that was the keeper for sure. I've got a soul thingy. Look at that. We gotta get rid of this heart. It's because we had Eden's blessing. I had the weirdest dream, guys. I had a dream that I had, like, a balloon that was an alien balloon. And the balloon made it where I could, like, wish for anything. Like, I would just be like, Balloon computer, I want a joint pre-rolled. And it would just magically pop up. Or balloon computer, I want this country to explode. And in anything I wanted, I could basically change whatever I wanted. But I've learned the more wishes I made, the more things I did, it was corrupting the world. And it was causing, like, things to go bad. So I had to go, my last wish, I had to go back in time and wish that I never made a wish. Um, thank you so much for the resub, I really appreciate that. I took no NyQuil. And then, at one point, my dream swapped over to me being a cartoon child, and I was in, like, a cartoon... And I had this balloon that granted wishes, and my wish was to have superhuman strength uh, for a little bit, because there was a bully at school that was picking on me. So the bully tried to walk up to me and, like, hit me, like, on the side of my head, and I just went, Kachow! and I fucked him up and hit him against the wall. But then the bully figured out it was because of my wish balloon, so he kept starting to, he started to try to pop my wish balloon. And I was, like, just fucking him up. I don't know, and then I then I woke up. Nice Frost X. It was it was pretty intense. It was a pretty intense dream. I also had a dream that I was like there was like I was like in a house. This was like a completely separate dream. That I had in the same night. And there was like this demonic lady. And she was trying to lead me through all the steps to like cleanse the house. But really she was just tricking me into making a blood sacrifice. So that more demons could come out. And like I had these swords and I had to go pop these magical runes. But like they were evil. And there was like all these corpses and blood and death. And I don't remember it too well. But it was such a fucked up dream. I don't even know, dude. It's crazy. Fuck pills. You gotta quit doing bath salts before you go to bed? I don't know what it is, man. I don't know what the problem is. Crazy.
Where do you want me to cram my piss? Not near me. Please. Spare us your piss, Lord. Hello, Yubazor. How you doing? Dude, that JonBenet Ramsey shit's got me all shook up. It's so crazy. I like the poop. What do you think dreaming that you're an ex-cop Shadowrunner means? I don't know. You'd have to look up dream translations online. I only know what a couple of them are supposed to mean. I'm not like a dream fortune teller or anything or like the fucking oracle from Matrix or anything like that. Yeah, I like the lump of coal blackberry. It's a pretty decent item. I really thought that's where that secret room was. Wrong. You are 60 years old and you are rapidly being unborn. I don't even know what that is, but I don't like it. Damn, I should have put money in my machine last run. Failure on my part. 33 is not bad, I guess. It's still something to work with, but we had 120 when we started today. Ouch. Oh, I don't want to be bigger. If you want to have vivid dreams, drink apple juice before bed. I don't. I don't want to have dreams at all. My dreams are crazy. I don't get good sleep when I have dreams like that. I just want to pass the fuck out and not dream about anything. They make me toss and turn and wake up and talk in my sleep. It's crazy. I'm sure it bugs the hell out of Lisa. I just can't stop myself. I give it five years and she's going to want to sleep in a different bed than me. Maybe less than that. Shit, maybe three years. Oh, Busty, your PC crashed again? That's the worst. What's up, Griffin the Greats? How you doing, brother? Gosh, I'm so ready for Afterbirth Plus, guys, and the new Gungeon DLC. Give it to me. Just get a bigger bed. We're gonna get a bigger bed. That is on the agenda. Oh, that is so tempting. But I'm Lilith. I'm the baby master. How do I trade that away unless I already have a year or something like that? What's up, Kolb, mister? How you doing? Pot suppresses REM sleep. Maybe I need to just start smoking mad amounts of marijuana. Anybody know where to get some in Memphis? If I inject it into my eyeballs or something, I don't have to smoke it, right? How does the pot work? Can I bake it into things? Do I just like take a big chunk of it and like slam it in some food? And I just chew the leaves up?
Now I'm gonna have dreams about chick chips, cookies, and jello. I meant to say pudding. I don't really like jello. Guys, jello or pudding? I'm more of a pudding kind of guy myself. Oh. I do not remember if they made it on YouTube or not.
too, if Mr. Robot was going to be as good as the first, but I think it's better. There aren't many shows like that. Ow! What's up, Killer Croc? <clears throat> Anybody in here watch Danganronpa? I don't know what the fuck that is. What is Danganronpa? I've seen a lot of streamers play that, but... Is that like a visual novel, or does it actually have gameplay? What is that? I have no clue. I got it just confuses me, honestly. Is that the one with the cat grills? I don't even fucking know. It's kinda like Phoenix Wright. Okay. It's both. It's a murder investor game with a visual novel elements. Okay. So it actually has gameplay. It doesn't just walk you through. Because there's a Steins Gate game that just came out. That's like an all a visual novel, but... I don't know. I heard it's not that great. I haven't watched the anime Steins Gate. I watched like the half of the first season and I really couldn't get into it. It just confused the hell out of me. Any interested in Bioshock Remastered? Not really. Um, I just don't... There's very few remastered games I'll get into, and the ones that I do, I prefer when they put bonus content in there, like Kingdom Hearts. I really love the Kingdom Hearts remixes because they put, like, in 1.5 and in 2.5, they put bonus bosses in there. 2.5 was awesome. With all of the unknown bosses, I thought that was great. I don't know if they put anything new in those Bioshock games. Remastering recent PC games, right? That's like, oh, Bioshock Infinite Remastered. Elder Scrolls Remastered. Like, the games don't look bad. You know, they, they look fine, I feel like. Oh, yeah, drop the bitty titties on me. The High Priestess. Um, Candle, meh. They didn't remaster Bioshock Infinite. I know, I was making a, I was making a joke. Um, I wasn't saying they did. I was like, that's like remastering, like, Bioshock Infinite. I can't, I can't push those back. This room sucks. That was close. Why can I not make a devil deal? I had Krampus the first fucking room. My eternal light doesn't matter with this laser shit I have. Like, what the hell? Silky Wilky! Oh, cram your bits in there. Oh, I love it. Cram them in there so good. Yeah, they need to remaster some of those games I've never played. Like, I've never played Oblivion or Morrowind. They remastered The Last of Us. Exactly. What the fuck? Why? Why? I don't get it. The bits are another way to support the streamer, basically. They're a way to cheer and chat, and the cup is just for fun. Where's my shop at, guys? I lost my shopperino.
Ooh, a dime. Remember that one time I got four dimes in a row? That was a maze balls. Four dimes in a row. That'll never happen again. I want a bomb for that chest from my shop. It was right by the boss room. Well, shit. I walked into it. Here it is. There's the bomb. It's excellent. Remaster, sell your game twice. Strats, man. Those strats. Ooh, I got a dark bum now. Didn't even notice the little guy. <clears throat> Bear Neo on Steam. Cheap and great reviews on a roguelike. Difficult too. Bear Let me pull this up. I'm always looking for good new roguelikes. Ten bucks. Oh, dude, it looks like fucking Minecraft. I can't. It's a 3D roguelike. I don't like those. Ugh. I like that, though. It looks like fucking Minecraft. Boom, Silky Wilky. Why do they all whip? I'm sorry, I don't know. Sorry they whiff. Ugh. Frustrates me too. I feel like the gray ones and the purple ones should whiff, but anything above that should be dead on target. Maybe bounce out, but that's it. They are making more. Well, that isn't... I mean... Okay. <clears throat> the cup is a lie. Oh man, my hand is really starting to hurt from this. All these dodgins and stuff. Mm. Might be balloons time after this, boys. The wow plus the Isaac is killing my left hand. My wrist? Oh, it hurts. Feels bad, man. The wow is a hand killer. So many buttons to click. Maybe I should make macros just for that. Do, do. Do, 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 do. I also want to play Subnautica. I know a bunch of new stuff came out for Subnautica. And I guess I'll take the bombs. Have you ever played Iron Cast? I have. That's a fun game. We need a WoW emote? Guys! We need 1,315 more subs to change our emotes without deleting 15 of them. Because Twitch said... That I have to have enough subs up to my current amount of emotes to be able to swap them out now. Before they were being cool about it. Now they're being dicks about it. I can't swap any of my emotes out anymore. So unless we magically get 1,300 more subs. Which would mean we would have to have 1,000 more subs than there are people in the channel right now. We're fucked! There's no way. So I've given up on emotes. I might just have to delete them. I don't know, guys. I might just have to delete them. Did I play Legend of Dragoon or Legend of Lagaya? I love Legend of Lagaya. I never did play Legend of Dragoon. Just start doing stripping shows, Cobalt. The sub trains will come in. 
Yeah, for about five minutes, then we'll get banned. Yeah, it sucks, Fritzels, but what can you do, man? Our all-time high for emotes was 2,600. I still owe you guys a tattoo for that. That was last year during the release for Rebirth or Afterbirth. And now we are at, uh, we're at 1,685. So I'm trying. I stream every single day, you know. I'm not going to sit here and beg for subs. Like, if people want to sub, that's great. If not, that's cool, too. I know sometimes it's strapped for money. Plus, Twitch, honestly, lately, um, statistically, it's hit a plateau for new viewers coming in. So, a lot of streams have lost 30 to 40% viewership, unless it's a bigger stream. On top of that, um, school's back. So, it's just a ton of factors... You know, it's unfortunate. I have, I've played Lost Castle. I even think some of my videos made it on YouTube. Uh, Fogel69. You know, it is what it is. Market saturation. There's, just, yeah, there's also tons more people streaming these days. Um, spreading, you know, viewers out across the board. It's, uh, it's interesting to keep up with everything. I mean, we're doing fine, dude. We have so many fucking people in here. Even if we had half of what we have right now, we would still be fine. If I drop if I drop 700 subs, then I'd have to start looking maybe at a career change. But that's a lot of subs to have to fucking drop for us to have to worry about that. So, I'm chilling right now. It just is really scary whenever you go to an event like PAX or TwitchCon because it's days off that you're not streaming. I usually lose anywhere from 10 to 20 subs a day, and we usually make up anywhere from 10 to 20 subs a day. Sometimes it's worse, sometimes it's better. I don't know. The stream's not all about money. The stream's about having fun and playing games. It just happens to be my job as well. Um, I'm super lucky to have that. I'm blessed. And you guys have the most amazing community, I feel like. You guys are super generous. Um, and I love you guys, so... Yeah, dude, I'll just continue to be a cam girl as long as I can. And even if I had to go get another job, I would still stream. I just wouldn't be able to stream every day. I wouldn't be able to stream as much. Um, I, I never want to have to stop streaming. I'll stream till the day I die as long as I can afford it, you know? Thanks, Cobalt's number one stalker. I can always rely on you. Matchbook, boys. Still no devil deal. Fuck. Does YouTube make you any money? I make about $350 from YouTube a month, Swizzle. And I pay my YouTube guy $75 a week. So I break even on YouTube. The great thing about YouTube is, though, it brings people into our Twitch channel. It just makes people more aware of our channel and what we do. So that's... I don't mind breaking even. Um, my YouTube guy does a fantastic job. Honestly, if my YouTube was doing better, I would pay him more, too. Um, you know, it's just one of those things. I don't have time to make YouTube-only content. Especially streaming, like, six hours a day. Yeah, easy game. See? Prime example right there of why YouTube is important. I watch the YouTube videos. That's awesome, man. It's also just a great way to ca uh, catalog a lot of our streams. Just so we have, like, you know, an organized, nice reference point for all the games we play and stuff. I just like having those, like, archived somewhere. That's not just Twitch. Feels good, man. That's awesome, Agarthen, yeah. That Eden streak, nice. Yeah, I don't play Eden Streaks anymore. I just feel like they're too easy. They're not challenging enough for me. Um, I get really bored with them really fast. But with a random streak, I never know what I'm going to get. We can get a Keeper Run or a Lost Run. And those are always like throwing a wrench into my plans. I really like that excitement. That, that just random factor, you know? 
Sometimes you try to chat on a YouTube video and you realize it's not live. Well, that's funny. I've heard that before, too. I don't want that eternal heart. I came from Chatterbait. Nice! Yeah, my feet cam, right? Yeah, Northern Lion's a little bit behind on, like, um... The popular streaks and all that stuff. He he's usually about six to eight months behind on whatever was most popular in the community. I feel like, but he does his own thing. He has his own gameplay style, and I respect him for that. He doesn't really care like what is in the the popular, um, you know, fucking community shit. I don't know how to explain it. I feel you, Lelicook. For some reason, I thought we were in Womb 1, but that was Triacnid, huh? We just finished that floor really fast. This Tech 10 Lilith run is weird. Okay, a sensor. We already have the Mega Stand key. Let's go. Not one... Devil deal this entire run that I could take. Not frickin' one. Wow. He's about 10 to 20 years behind in pop culture references. Yeah, but he remembers people and actors and like what year they were born and like the exact quotes of shit. I can't do that. My memory is too bad for that. I don't know a lot of actors' names or the names of people in bands or anything like that. I just know whether I like something or not. Don't touch me, Gertie Gumdrops. What's up, E.T. Giggles? It's great to see ya. Hope your life in Sweden is going well. That's two guppy pieces. We almost made the guppy, not quite. Do you know who Jack Black is? Yeah, I hear about how I look like Jack Black all the time. Yeah, it's usually hard for me to remember birthdays too and stuff like that. Top left. What's up, continue? Thanks, continue. Happy birthday to the ground. Into the chest, little boy. Let's see what we got here. World card. Forget me now. Look at these babies, though. All the robo babies. Oh man, that's that's a bundle of fun right there. What a bundle of joy that is. Hey, Ecleptic, how you doing? Awesome, Sir Chicken. Yeah, he's a good friend of mine. I actually got to have lunch with him and stuff at PAX and walk around the floor a bit with him. They were trading their magic cards in. They got a steam vent. Traded a bunch of cards in and got a steam vent. A hundred and ten dollar card. I was just like, what the fuck? These magic cards be expensive. Yeah, Silky Wilky. Fill it up, daddy. You are the bit king of the week, sir. I wonder who our bit leaders are. We're gonna go back into a full clear before Mega Stan. I also maybe want to use a Forget Me Now. 
I haven't quite made my mind up yet. A conjoined would be awesome. Okay, let's double trouble here. Woo! Nice. Well done. Thanks, Lelica. I hope to be here for many years to come, my friend. Better now, better now. You love magic, you wasted so much money. It's not a waste, though, if you have fun with it. For me, I've wasted money because I have nobody to play with me. I need more real-life friends. I have one good real-life friend who lives here. Well, I have a couple, but I see one of them more often than others. Um... Yeah, I don't know. Most of my friends live in, like, Seattle now. Let's see, I have two friends that live in Colorado, one friend that lives in Hawaii, one friend that lives in Florida, um, and, like, 50 friends who live in Seattle. There's a key. What do you plan to do after Twitch? Um, retire. Lord Timogen. Honestly. And if I don't have enough money to retire, I'll probably go into IT or be a community manager for some sort of gaming company. I know a lot of streamers that have good connections with game developers. I would love, love, love to get into game development where I can, like, help produce a game and help also with, like, game design. I can't draw, I can't program, but I have lots of ideas, and I know what different mechanics that make good games. So I hope to be in the gaming industry for a long, long time. Um, and I know that there's companies out there that would hire me for different jobs, but I hope to be a streamer for as long as I can be. I love my job, I love my community, I love entertaining people, I love jerking off. That's maybe irrelevant. Firebird! Three months in a row. Welcome back. Thanks, Busty. First thing I hear is jerking off. Yeah, some people come in at awkward times. It wasn't really relevant to the topic either. I just felt like throwing a jerk-off joke in there. Who is dropping bits? Is it Silky Wilky? My money's on Silky Wilky. Empty cup. Fill it up. Empty cup. Fill it up. How many bits have been dropped today? Most people wouldn't share this information with their channel, but I think it's cool because, like, I'm proud of it, you know? We have had 6,000 bits drop today. That is amazing. Thank you guys so much for your generosity. 6,000 bits! Woo! Oh my gosh, and Slipknot blowing it up. Or did he whiff? Oh, nope. There it goes. 6,000 bits in three hours. That's... Ooh, that's like making $20 an hour. That's a damn good job right there. That's not even including the new subs we got today. Daddy, please. Why are you guys so nice to me? I don't I do not deserve it. I do not deserve it. Ooh, easy games. Getting in on that love. It stays full. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, purity. We got the move speed purity. That kind of sucks. There's some people that jerk off in 
There are serial killers and there are serial kills that also jerk off and there's no in between. Serial killers in like, they kill whole grain oats? Like what? Those whole grain oat killers, watch out for them. All right. Let's go. <clears throat> nice and easy, Mr. Squeezy. Got him. You devour cereal every morning? I heard yogurt's actually not that good for you because of all the sugar in it. Must stay full. Silky! Don't fall into the Trenton shit. Before you know it, you'll be a fucking halfway to a to a sun badge. Praise it and 420 blaze it. Somebody's commenting on my YouTube right now, I think. Or tweeting at me. I love that I can see my Twitter now, guys. It's completely fixed. I can see every comment, every follow. Oh, it's a beautiful thing. What's up, Torch? What up, Daddy? Oh, easy. Fill her up. <laughs> Mega Stan will fall before Lilith. Victory for Kappa! Yogurt has zero sugar in it. Really? Lisa was telling me that yogurt has lots of sugar daddies in it. Curse of the Unknown. Prop Tibbity Tosis. Fuck it, I'll take this too. Scatter bit bizoms. Telepathy for dummies. Beautiful. The proptosis doesn't look like it changes the size of them at all, but... Oh, the damage increase, I can feel it. 1,500 from Firebird, the biggest bit of the day. Woo, that's a big old bit right there. Oh my god. That's a big bit. And it nailed us, too. <laughs> yeah, the tech's weird, though, on Lilith. The ring doesn't get any bigger than that, <clears throat> even if I hold it down. Oh. Doo -doo -doo -doo. <laughs> Greek yogurt? Yeah, but I heard some company got in trouble for pretending to be Greek yogurt, but actually it had a lot of sugar in it, and it wasn't actually Greek yogurt, and it was really bad for you. This is all stuff that Lisa was telling me. Enjoy your wow, Bohemoth. Enjoy, sir. Do -do 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 -do. It 
would suck if the bits what didn't go in the cup you don't get. That would suck. Yeah, but the program's just for fun. It's all external. You just got a legendary? Oh my fuck. For Prot Pally. Get wrecked. Get wrecked. You know what? I don't even feel bad for you. You already knew. <clears throat> I didn't really care who my off tank was. I just wanted to be the main tank of the guild. If I was going to make a guild, I wanted to main tank. Because that's my favorite thing to do. It's not my fault if everybody went off and made tanks. I don't feel bad at all. But grats! AJ Heathen, 11 months in a row. Woo! Thank you, AJ. I really appreciate that. That's almost an entire year of being a sub. Fuck it! Victory for! Wait, no, no, let's full clear. Hey, Domus! You sexy subscriber, you! Ow! I was hoping for a dad's key. Hoping against hope. I figured a lot of people would just off-spec uh, tank and then main-spec DPS, but oh, a lot of people went tank. I know Luke Spence, who is Lels in our guild, was kind of salty that he wasn't being able to tank, but fuck it, man. I'm doing great today, DQ. What's up, baby? Hey, Bruce Millis. That name, though. All right, well, I guess this is a win. This makes us 10 and 0, boys. 10 and 0, let's go. <coughs> it is harder to off spec because of the artifacts, I know. That kind of, it's kind of bullshit, too. <laughs> 